with Gurner. Blue shirts combining nicely. That's going to be high. It's going to be too high. Pressure on the far side of the field. It gets touched off the top. Jinx on the floor. But it's a turnover into the wind and a chance for Yaka to level this one. Looks downfield, surveys it, doesn't see what she wants. Tissant cuts. It's going to be a, a high disc in his quarter. Fingertip of Tissant and he's down into the floor. Reader with the turn. The French have opened the door. Can they slam it shut again? Oh, it's just beyond the fingertips of Ness and Nick. And a brilliant shot to the far side. Castillo bids. He can't bring it up. It's back in the German hands. They know Mondio can throw if they get too close to her. She can throw around anything. And a big bid. Ness and Nick keeping it alive for Jinx. And another bid required. Another bid comes. Jinx fighting hard to get this turn. Schultze looks at the line and uh, Mondio comes through with a run through block of her own it's more ultimate more ultimate right here on Ulti TV bringing you all the action from Tom Turney as Ali Mondio and as a point block finding a way through it's a cross field pass Libert to Schall oh it's a touch and it's a knock away and it can't be contained and Jinx found a way through the Yaka zone, but they could not complete the point. A little touch, maybe, on the fingertips. Gurner just reaches forward, realised straight away that was going to be too low, just launches. Keeping the air conditioning thoroughly turned up to 10. Into the end zone, Becker grabs, and it's uh, another offensive clean hole, though. Change of direction. Sends it across the top, visionary put. Well read all the way in. Schultze with the provision of the first break of the game. It goes the way of Jinx. Yeah. Myself and Rachel are sitting here wrapped in at least four layers. It is very cold in the shade, very hot in the sun. The wind's coming towards us in the camera, but don't let the pictures uh, fool you. It's, a, it's an interesting weather condition to play it. Yaka, big arm, Castillo underneath it. She chases it down, she reads it well, she catches it in. But her ability to get free continuously on offense is so useful to this team. But Castillo for Yaka sends a big disc up. Oh, it's caught the, the wind beautifully. And Van Week. A bit of a messy point for both teams. Yaka looking for a spicy hammer into the open space. Needs the layout, keeps it up. Is she out of the zone? It's a goal. It's, it's been signaled as a goal by Jinx and a great grab. Straight into the ground. Didn't need any defence. Gurner opens up the shoulder straight away. He's going to have to come back in. It's bouncing in the wind beautifully. And Wagner reels it in. The seeding decisions have been made um, and they were really clear on the roster when that went out. Big shot coming up here from Jinx. Simona Libert comes down with it. Oh, it looks so smooth and easy. Finding a way through to Gurner. There's a space in the end zone. It just needs to float. It just needs to fly. She just needed to get horizontal. Uh, blow by blow, every stride is a painful one. Castillo launches the arm, Van Week in the end zone, and she reads it perfectly and takes it down. De La Val is uh, lurking, but it goes across instead to the 26 shirts of Mateus. Meisel sends the big launch, De La Val chasing it down, she reads it in and it's smooth and clean. Perfectly. Mondio again. Big fake. Oh, this time the break side. What a visionary pot from Mondio. Can it stay in? Paola Vass reads it. Mondio. She had no right field. Tired German legs. Exciting Yaka defense and the big pressure moment of this game. Scala sends it to Liebert. This time it's clean. This time it's caught. And we are at sudden death. It's a, a reset option to Delaval. She comes over ahead, but she reads it and has time leading the receiver. Gurner takes it away, goes to the ground. It's going to be a big bit. There's her arms in the air and it's come down with Castello in the end zone for Yaka. They win the game. Incredible action. But it's a French win for Tom's tourney.